Hi everybody, welcome to my channel. Today I'm making ropa vieja. If you have ever been to a Cuban restaurant, you've seen this on the menu. These are all the ingredients. It's just a little bit of prep work, cutting up those different colors of bell pepper, one medium onion, and a few other things. Combined, it makes a delicious dinner. Now this is a very much dump everything in the crock pot meal. So I'm going to start off with my bell peppers. All these different colors and it looks beautiful. Next, I'm going to add my onion. And that's just a rough chop on those onions. And after this, I'm putting in my two pounds of roast. I'm adding all my seasonings. Now believe me, everything will combine in the end. You just dump it all in here. This is tomato paste. Now I have one can of diced tomatoes along with one can of beef broth. Now if you only have chicken broth, that'll work. Now if you think there's not enough juice, don't worry about it. This meat will let out its own juices. There will be a lot of juice in the end of this recipe. You're gonna cover it and put it on low for eight to 10 hours until your meat is super tender. Now, ropa vieja means old clothes. Old clothes, they usually are torn or shredded. Well, we're gonna shred this meat. So now you just shred it into small bite-sized pieces. Now you're going to return it to all your seasoned juice. The flavors combined and it's so tasty. You're gonna bring up some of those bell peppers on the bottom. Just incorporate everything. This is such a good dinner. If you go to a restaurant, a Cuban restaurant will give you a choice of steamed rice and black beans. I'm only making some rice to go with this meal, but with those vegetables, it is so out of this world. And I'm giving you guys another hint. What I'm going to do is separate, maybe tomorrow, I'll separate the meat with the juice, and I will make Mexican taquitos with that meat. And with the juice, I'm going to add that to some rice. You can look for those, those two recipes on my channel. I hope you enjoyed this demonstration. Thank you for watching.